Hello again, it's Mr. Dixon, your Too Cool for School counselor, back with another episode of Mr. Dixon's Doodles. Today, we're going to talk about diversity. First, we'll start by describing what diversity is. After that, we'll discuss why diversity is important and how we can work to accept the differences of others. Simply put, the word diversity means the differences in people throughout the world. Every day you'll come across people that are different than you in one way or another. In this video, we'll discuss some of the ways people are different than others and highlight why that's important. One of the first things you might notice is that someone's skin is a different color than yours. Someone can have lighter skin than you and also darker skin than you. Different skin colors are found throughout the world. Usually people who have family from hotter places will have darker skin because it protects them better from the sun. Isn't that pretty cool? You might also notice that people are different sizes. You'll see people that are shorter and taller than you. You'll probably also see people that are smaller and bigger than you. A lot of the time, people will have a size similar to their family members. For example, if someone comes from a tall family, they'll usually be tall too, but not always. Another type of diversity you might see is with differently abled people. Someone who is differently abled might need help or do something in a different way than you would. For example, instead of walking, someone who is differently abled might use a wheelchair to get around. People can be differently abled due to how they were born, aging, or maybe if they had an accident throughout their lifetime. Either way, they can do just as much as you, but they just have a different way of getting the job done. Diversity also has to do with where people are from and their culture. America is called the melting pot of the world because we have so many different people living in our country. Even though people live here now, they may have been born in another country. It's kind of cool to think that someone you're talking to could be from somewhere so different. Imagine all of the stories you could share with each other. As you grow up, you'll also notice family diversity. This can be diversity with how much money families have or who all lives in the family home. You can sometimes see money diversity by people having different clothes, different technology, and other things than you do. People will also have different individuals living in their houses. Some people will live with just one of their parents, some with both. Some people will even live with grandparents, step-parents, aunts, and uncles. There's so many different types of families, and families can be so diverse. Now that we've talked about some different types of diversity, let's discuss why it's important. Diversity is important because it helps us all to learn different things and experience more of the world. Life would get pretty boring if everyone we met was like us. That's why it's important to appreciate the things that make us different and unique. You should be proud of yourself and your own diversity, no matter your size, skin color, body ability, culture, and the amount of money that you or your family have. You offer something to the world that no one else can, and that something is you. The best way we can embrace diversity is by keeping an open mind and not judging a book by its cover. Not judging a book by its cover means that we don't judge people just by the way they look. We should accept people no matter their differences because like I said, our diversity is what makes life interesting. When you meet people who appear different than you, ask them questions, get to know them, and be a friend to them. Imagine if you were in a situation where you felt different than everyone else or felt like an outsider. You can be the person that makes them feel welcome and also learn a lot in the process. Throughout this video, you've learned about what diversity is and different types of diversity, why diversity is important, and how we should form friendships with people who are different than us. Remember, there are so many things in this world that make us different. At the end of the day, we are all humans. Being different in a way does not make you better or worse than anyone. It just makes you different. We should embrace the things that make us diverse and unique and also accept the things that make others different. The world's a much more interesting place when we do. That's all for our lesson on diversity. Until next time, remember you are competent and capable, so always be confident. See ya!